What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, I'll show you how to draw and color Bobbert from the amazing world of Gumball. Let's begin today's lesson at the top center of our page and draw a large circle for the eye. We're gonna start at the very top. Let's work our way around towards the bottom of our circle. And go all the way around the right side, going back up towards the top. Now you wanna trace that circle along the inside. So we're gonna start back at the top, step down, now you want to leave an even space gap all the way around. Now let's place the pupil in the center. We're going to start at the very top on either side. Start with two straight lines coming down of equal length. Now on the top left, we're just going to connect this up and then down like a half circle. Come down to the bottom left, curve the bottom going around and then up. Let's fill the inside of the pupil. Now with the eye in place, we're going to round out the bottom of the head. Let's line up with the bottom of the circle all the way over towards the left side. It's going to curve the head coming down, round this out, and then pull that up on the right. Now I'm going to draw two straight lines going up the side of the head, going up to right about there. And then we'll connect the top with another curve. Bring this up towards the top of the head, round this out, and then come down on the right. Let's add a line coming down the left side of the head, starting from the very top, come straight down. I'm going to step over and draw that again, coming all the way down towards the bottom. And then we'll fill that stripe in black. Let's add two half circles on the side of the head, starting from this point, curve this around, and then bend that in just above that bottom point. And we'll draw two oval buttons on the bottom left side. Let's start from the bottom, start with a straight line going across, step up, and draw that three more times. Let's close off the left side with a curve along the top and the bottom button, and do the same thing along the inside. Now I'm gonna move down and draw the side of the body. Let's start over on the left, draw a straight line coming down, Go over towards the right and do the same thing. Coming down towards the same height. And close off the bottom with a curve coming down the middle and then bend that back up. On the left side, we're gonna step up and draw another curve. Let's add a small circle on the bottom left for a button. Now we're gonna tuck the legs in underneath the body. We're gonna start right in the middle, start with a straight line coming down towards the bottom of the heels, and then we'll round out the bottom of the feet. From the bottom of this line, curl the foot coming down and up towards the left and right side. Let's round out the feet. It's gonna round this out and pull that back in. Now from here, draw a straight line going up underneath the body. Let's go halfway down the leg and add a curve to the edge of the boot. Now let's go back up to the top and draw on the arms. From the top of the body, we're gonna step down, draw a straight line going out, and we'll just bend that down towards the wrist. Let's line this up on the right. Going straight out, and we'll bend this down towards the same height. Now from the bottom of the arm, draw a straight line coming in, I'm gonna follow that same curve going up and then in toward the side of the body. Now you wanna connect these two points with a circle, starting on the left, going all the way around and then back up. Let's add one small circle in the center. Now let's go back and add some lines inside the arm. 
from the side of the body, let's step out, draw one line, step out, draw that again. From the elbow, we're gonna angle this up and out towards the outside. And we'll add one more straight line going across the arm. Now let's draw two hook fingers on either side. Starting from the inside of the hand, curl this around and then down. Go to the outside, come around and then in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Let's flatten off the ends with a short line. And we'll follow that curve going back up in towards the hand. Now let's grab our dark blue marker and fill that ring around the eye. Fill those covers around the ears. And we'll fill in the arms and the hands. Going around that little circle in the center. Trim across the bottom of the body. And these are red to fill in those buttons on the head. And we'll use this medium gray for the fingers. I'm using gray to add a highlight across the eye. Just adding two curves, and we'll fill in the top. And using our light gray, we're gonna add a shadow on the right side. Starting from the top of the head, and just bending that out towards the right and the bottom. And once we finish adding our shadows, we'll be sure to sign out our work. And that's pretty much it. That's how we draw and color Bobbert from the amazing world of Gumball. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please make sure you subscribe because I'm posting new lessons every single day. You can also drop your requests in the comments below. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.